we are here today going to Kingdom Fitness. Um, I'll link their Instagram below. Where are you? Kingdom Fitness California if you guys want to check them out. They sell gym equipment. Um, and I think we're just going to get their coated plates. Yeah, rubber coated uh, cast iron plates. Yeah, because we just got our mask. Because we need to eat. <laughs> we get it because plates. <laughs> we... <laughs> We just got our gym mats um, and the squat rack and the bench. So we are going to wait for our barbell, which is another week. So you'll, you guys will see this in another week or two. We'll see. So I've been working out every day this week and if you guys want to purchase any of these items, I feel like I can give you guys my honest review. I am definitely not an expert but this is just the start of our home gym that Christian did a lot of research for. Starting with this barbell, I definitely like this barbell because of the color and it's pretty sturdy to the point where it won't bend once you put more weight to the barbell. It did come with the weight clips and the barbell came nice and oiled up. It's 45 pound Olympic barbell and we actually got it when there was a deal going on but it's not on sale anymore but I'll just link the website right here. I definitely can't do chest with this barbell yet just because it's too heavy that's why we got this Olympic curl bar but that too is pretty heavy so dumbbells is always handy. But the barbell for the squats is amazing along with this foam bar pad. Whoa. The foam bar pad is not too thick and short like the ones you see at the gym. If you guys know what I mean. <laughs> for the bench, I have some pros and cons with. Some pros is that you can definitely adjust the bench to do multiple different exercises and I like how the bench is separate from the bar catch. Some cons is that the bench is too high so if you want to do hip thrusts with the barbell it is a bit difficult um, or more like uncomfortable. The bench is implanted to the floor so you can move it which can be a good or bad thing. You can move the bench so that you can have room to do squats. And another con is that the width of the bench is a little more difficult for me to sit in because I have to spread my legs wider and since the bench is a little higher, my feet isn't planted to the floor so I'm basically tiptoeing. The preacher curl has this pad that is adjustable and you can remove the curl handle really easily. The only thing that I would change is the handles. If they can rotate on its own while doing the curls, it would be so much better because the rubber part on the curl handle will slide around and you basically have to push it back in. The leg extensions is adjustable too but again this is a guy's bench so I don't think it fits a woman's figure unless you're really tall then it works out. The dumbbell set comes with 5 to 25 pound pair of dumbbells and this lovely rack to hold your dumbbells. And the best part is Christian also got this on sale but sadly the sale is over too. <laughs> I just like the rubber hex shape heads to prevent it from rolling and it's better for your floors too. The gym pad is also from Amazon. When you were a kid, did you ever have those foam playmat road toys? It basically felt like that but durable. Still feeling these pads out but so far I like them. The items that we got from Kingdom Fitness are these bumper plates, Olympic curl bar, and the kettlebell which Christian and I definitely recommend. It is intimidating once you arrive but once you're inside everyone is super friendly and is happy to help you guys if you have any questions and we'll load them into your car too. 
And now with the gym, if you see the strip lights, there's a gap. The reason why there's a gap is because we are going to add one more column of IKEA mirrors. So I didn't want to cut more of the strip lights until we get more of the IKEA mirrors. Makes sense. But this is how it will look like for now. And we also got this side table from IKEA as well for this TV that my roommate sister gave. I also got new resistant bands since I broke my other one since those were rubber. These fabric bands are so much better and it doesn't slide up and down your legs and since it's wider, it's definitely more comfortable on your legs too. And last but not least, I got new workout gloves just because my old ones are pretty beat up so these ones come in handy. And I like these ones just because it wraps around my wrists since my wrists are getting weaker. But that's it for our gym dance room. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you haven't seen how I put these mirrors together, I'll definitely put a link up here for you guys to watch. But if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and join the fam, and we will see you next time. Bye!